Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Taurus December 20, 2022. Social involvements are larger than life for you today. Activities that draw out your inner child can be satisfying. Mars in your sign gives your personality a little more muscle these days, which can be super when you need to accomplish something a little out of your usual comfort zone. However, sometimes you can step over yourself in your haste to get where you want to go, especially with Mars retrograde. Today, Mars and Pluto connect in a tense aspect, and you might quickly grow frustrated with others who don't seem to be talking straight with you. You also feel your desires with more intensity and urgency, complicating matters. Your best bet is to rise above the game playing and focus on softening and moderating your impulses, but it can be very tempting to get involved. Reach to the heavens and soak up the light pouring down upon you. The heavens above are shining so sweetly. As lovely Luna sings hymns from the tapestry above, she'll transit through a fellow sign, also known as your solar fifth house of true love, passion, and romance. This will put you in the mood for pleasure and fun, especially if you've been feeling quite busy with such a hectic work and life balance. Whenever the moon dances through this sector, you have a beautiful moment for intimacy and sensuality. Schedule a first date or agree to meet up with someone who ignites the fire within your heart. Do you feel empowered by your decisions? You may be focused on whether or not your investment is paying off and the moon in Scorpio squares Pluto in Capricorn. Instead of getting in your head, you can use this transit to reconsider what you want to invest in or further pursue. You can always make adjustments at any point in time. Later in the day, the moon will enter its fall, Scorpio. Do not be surprised if your attention shifts to your habits and routine since the fixed moon will be focused on your productivity. A week after the moon wrapped up its last visit to your income sector for the year, its return to your work sector today comes in time to support Jupiter in his final two days in your career sector. With no planetary activity on the income front, as things come together on the job and career fronts you have the sharp nose for money the moon left you with to draw on. The planetary alignment gives you the opportunity to bring the exotic into your life. Remember that other cultures can give us insight into ourselves that can light up our lives. Whatever exotic means to you, give it a try. Try to stimulate at least three of your senses with something new, taste, sound, smell, etc. The new does not need to disturb the things that give your life structure and regularity. Stick to your usual dietary boundaries while welcoming new ingredients and flavors into your kitchen. This is a day making it an opportune time for you to get caught up by tying up all the loose ends in your work. Make that to-do list and concentrate on completing all the tasks. Wait until tomorrow before starting anything new. The energy will be far better for that then. Take care of the things that are half done, and when everything is finished, you can start thinking of what you want to do next. Everything will come together better this way. There is a turnaround on the professional front today, with the work and life balance tension of the last few days dropping back just as the moon returns to your work sector in time to guide you into Jupiter's final two days in your career sector. The next two days will see the moon join forces with all three planets in your career sector to both bring this professional year home but also work with those planets that will stay on to keep the momentum going after he leaves. The next two days are all about leaving no room for regret on the job or career fronts. It is in the final hours of the moon's last visit to your romantic sector for the year that two exciting events take place simultaneously. It is while the moon is at a friendly aspect to Saturn in an adventurous part of your chart and as the spirit of romance and adventure spikes that the dwarf planet Ceres will return to your romantic sector to begin her first deep dive into your heart's needs and priorities in four years. Our eyes in the sky. A trine between the moon and Saturn this morning can help us when it comes to matters of the heart. If you're single, the energy helps you appreciate your independence, while those in relationships can find a new level of support in their partnership. This aspect can help you balance a romantic relationship with your autonomy if you're ready to move away from codependent or unhealthy behaviors as a couple. 
If you're ready to leave an unsatisfactory relationship, use this energy to make a clean break and move on with your life. Your energy level should stay fairly elevated throughout the day, so use this time to take care of business and get things done. Most people you communicate with professionally will be on an emotional edge today so be careful. Find solid ground and stick to it. Your productivity depends highly on your ability to remain emotionally stable. It will be harder than you think but don't give up. Your mind will feel sharp this afternoon as the moon aspects Pluto. You should have a clearer understanding of how you need to revolutionize and change your life moving forward, giving you the opportunity to implement change. Pluto lends some support to this mission, offering the passion and drive to take action toward personal evolution. Wild Bob-related accusations will spread around, and many of them will not be so nice. Approach the source of these rumors instead of continuing the negative downward cycle of badmouthing others without dealing with the heart of the matter. You have almost always conformed to every standard and wanted to fit in. Now you have set your sights on a wild one and you feel chills running up and down your spine. Due to your differing perspectives on life this is not a match made in heaven, but if you want to shrug off your conventional side for a while and take a walk on the wild side then by all means stop waiting and just do it. As we head into evening, the Scorpio moon makes it the perfect time to have discussions and connect with people on an intellectual level. If you find that your mind is exceptionally active, try to do some journaling before bed so you can fall asleep more easily. In the pre-dawn hours, the moon trines Saturn in Aquarius, allowing us to trust our instincts when undertaking negotiations. Want to reach an agreement? Try an untested approach to achieve compromise. If you aren't doing your job with passion, then why do it? Today is one of those days in which you should feel inspired to work harder than usual. If you aren't, then maybe you should consider finding new work. Your happiness depends on it. While the moon is in Scorpio, we can fail to advocate for ourselves, because we believe others have a greater stake in the matter than we do. Yet, as the moon and Saturn trine, we are better able to stick to our guns. A cooperative effort isn't truly cooperative if we're doing all the sacrificing. Use your imagination. The more creative you are, the better. Your ideas may seem rather unorthodox, but this doesn't mean that they hold no merit. Your innovative approach to an old problem is likely to propel you miles ahead of the competition. Mid-afternoon, the moon sextals the Sagittarius sun, a harmonious influence. At this time, we are especially concerned with taking the right action. We care about justice and fairness, and if a situation does not allow us to act with integrity, we want no part of it. Even if our mettle is tested, doing the moral thing is the only option now. Others' acknowledgement of our ethics and our positive attitude will cause them to gravitate toward our social circle. 